Lowell is a beautiful diversity filled with people from all over the world. Immigrants are people and individuals who move from their birth country to a new country, searching for a better life and more opportunity. Immigrants can be our friends, our neighbors, our teachers, and even our parents too. Immigrants enrich our city with culture, food, music, and history, which is what makes our city so special. The best way to represent the city of Lowell is our gardens. Mill City Groves has over seven community gardens where people from all over the city from different backgrounds come together and grow. We have such an array of food being grown right here in Lowell, and I want to share it with you. Today, we are at the Smith Street Garden with our special guest, Enrique. All right, my name is Enrique Vargas. Uh, you can just call me Enrique. Uh, uh, I'm the gardens manager here at Mill City Groves. Um, so like, what is a community garden? All right, so a community garden, uh, it has a, a lot of uh, meanings, but basically our community gardens are places where like uh, people uh, have their own space so they can grow uh, their own food because otherwise they don't have a, a place, whether it's at home, they don't have a, a yard because uh, they live in a building. As you can see, a lot of these houses around here, they're like very next to each other. So there's not really space uh, uh, in, in their yards or they just don't have one because they're in an apartment. So we actually, uh, it, is, it is space like this one where you get like a box and you're actually able to grow all your produce and vegetables that you want throughout the year. Like, like what was your like favorite meal like as a kid? Like if you were a fourth grader, like what was like, if you're, I think like nine, 10 years old, what was your favorite food eating? Yeah, it was like a, a, a like a, like a, you know like from our tradition or like in Puerto Rico like uh, we have this thing called mofongo, and it's uh, it's kind of funny because I didn't like it at first, and then the first time I ever had it, uh, yeah, I was still very little, but like when I was a kid, I was like I don't like it, I don't like it, you know, like I was like I want to have a burger, you know, and then the 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 thing was, and this is a funny story too, and how it became my favorite food right there and then there. Uh, I was, uh, my mom had cooked it and it's like made out of plantain and it's also like made, uh, you know, every, every people make it, every family makes it a little different. In my house, you make the, the little bowl of the mofongo, which is like the plantain and it has like a chicharron in it, uh, which is kind of like a pork skin. And then, you know, it's like a little bowl and you put it on, on, on a broth, on like a beef broth or a chicken broth. In that case it was chicken. And then... So I was like, I don't like it, I don't like it. And then one of those moments where I was like, I don't like it, my mom just grabbed the spoon and put it in my mouth. And I was like, I love this. This is my favorite thing in the world right <laughs> there and there. And ever since that day, that's like been my favorite food in the world. Uh, so yeah. It's like, it's like one of the biggest, actually it's the biggest community garden in Lowell too. So there's like 40. So, so here in the end, this garden, we got people from yeah, like Salvador, Brazil, um, uh, I think Cameroon and Mali. Uh, uh, we have people from Laos, Cambodia. As you can see, our community gardens are bursting with beautiful foods being grown from people from all different backgrounds. Our gardens would be so special and diverse without the people that are growing in it. Thank you, Enrique, for helping us discover and learn more about the community gardens.